<laughs> you can't get me. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. <laughs> What's the matter, Mary? Daddy. What? Come here, Daddy. What's the matter out there? Come here. Okay. Hey. It's a fish. What's the fish doing out here? Think a bear dropped it? Ain't any bears this far south. Mm, nearest river is about ten miles north. Where did it come from? I don't know, Marianne. Maybe a, a bird dropped it? Maybe. Listen, I don't want either of you going near it. Leave it for the scavengers. Now go play elsewhere. What was out there? A dead fish. Out in the grass. A dead fish? That's what I said. Where did a fish come from? I don't know. Well, must have come from somewhere. Must have. But from where, I do not know. Dinner should be done in an hour. Did you finish cutting the firewood? Most of it. Most? I've been at it all day. Got tired, needed something to drink. You'll need to get into town soon. I know, Josephine, I know. I'll take Jonathan with me when I sail to McCray in Ten Spring. Must you do business with that grubby old spud of a man? He's got the only general store this side of the Canadian River, Joe. You know that. And he's the only man who still does business with me. You haven't no one to blame but yourself. Do not start with me, Josephine. I'm not in a good mood for an argument. Yes, I realize it was my fault. I've apologized to you more times than I can count. I hear that Cyril Carter is looking for men to work for him. Where did you hear that? Carla Boone came by with her children yesterday while you were gone. Boone? That lady you used to teach school with? Yes. She said she heard Cyril Carter is hiring men for ranch hand work, I believe. Please promise you will go speak to him when you are in town next. You know he pays well. <sighs> I promise you. I love you, Samuel. I love you too.